I used to be an adventurer like you. Then I took an arrow in the knee. Alright guys, what I'm going to show you how to do in this tutorial is how to fix up your creation kit any for Skyrim Anniversary Edition so that you can load multiple master files and have it read all of the BSAs. I have a creation kit in here, just a vanilla one here on my desktop. So I'm going to have to make some changes to this. So the first line I'm going to add is going to be B you got to type this correctly allow multiple master loads B allow equals 1 equals 1 and then go down to the next line and Go ahead and copy this. Copy. And then paste it back in here. Now, you're going to have to uh, change this and have this say files. Right? All right. And then scroll on down to your archives here, and you'll see that. You have S Resource Archive List 2. You're going to have to add some things to this. Now, open up your Anniversary Edition folder here. Because you're going to need to add the BSAs at the end of this. So put a comma, space, and then go ahead and double click on this so like it's renaming and then copy this. Make sure you copy it. Don't change the name of it. Then paste it in here. Control V works. Put a comma and a space. And then you want to go and grab the next one. Like this here. Copy. Make sure you don't change it. Space. Control V. Paste it in there. Comma. Space. And then you want to grab the next one, Curios, copy. And basically, it's the same thing for all of it. And make a comma and space. And then the last one is for survival mode. Copy. And then paste that one right in here. Make sure you... Get close to this and paste that in there. Just like that. And that is done. So you save that. Just like that. And go ahead and... If you've got it already in your... If you've got it already in your Skyrim folder, you're fine. I'm just going to go ahead and I'm going to paste this one in here. And I'm going to replace... Replace that. And just to make sure, I'm going to do it again. Like that. And let's open up the creation kit for Skyrim Special Edition Anniversary Edition. So I am using creation kit, any uh, creation kit 64 fixes. So, and I'll just pick. I'll just pick my Storm Song Estate here. And I want to add the fish and survival mode and curious and that right there. And then I'm going to set this active file and then push OK and let this load up. And luckily, with the Creation Kit Fixes 60 Creation Kit 64 Fixes mod. Everything loads up fairly quickly.
And it is... Done. And it loads it all up. So I'm going to go ahead. And if you look at, look at file, you go ahead and click on the folder here. And it will say all that's, all that's good. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to save this. I'm going to close the kit and I'm going to reopen it. And when it's open, I'll be right back. Okay, and I'm back. Now if I click on this, and that's my active file. You can see in the list over here, it, it loads up everything with its own master file for the WS Forever. So it'll all load up the way it's supposed to. And once this opens up, I'll be right back. And there it is right there. Let's open this up and I like I said, it all loads up correctly. And that's going to be it for that. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. And remember, guys, if you like the content, don't forget to hit that like button. And also subscribe. And if you found this information helpful, look down in the description. You'll find a link to the Ko-Fi page. You can go ahead and tip channel on the Ko-Fi page, and that would be great. All right, guys. Until next time, remember to keep your sword sharp. Don't be a milk drinker, and always watch the skies, traveler.